welcome to South London. How excited are you to be a Palace player? Yeah, buzzing. Um, finally through the door um, and excited to get going. And a question I ask everyone, why Palace? Um, look, it's a great club, great manager, um, as you can see, great facilities um, and a lot of good players. Obviously, did well last year. Uh, hopefully, we can continue that. Um, a lot of young, exciting players as well and um, you know, it'll be good to be a part of. What has the summer been like for you? How have you kept in shape? Yeah, the summer's been busy. Um, I've had a while off, to be fair, but um, went to the gym while I was on holiday with the family. Um, and I had a couple of weddings to go to, stuck to the gym um, and then obviously we're in through the door now, did my first session um, and it's good to, to, to feel the ball. Moving to a completely new place down here in London, are you looking forward to kind of a bit of a new adventure? Yeah, yeah, it's a long way from Manchester but um, like you said it's going to be a good adventure. Um, I'm excited to, to start the adventure and I think so is my missing and kids so um, It'll be, it'll be good. Now we're in, it's, it's, the adventure started. You've already done a session and then met some of your teammates. What players here do you already know? Um, yeah, no, I know a couple of players. Will Hughes, Jeffrey Slope, um, Jack Butland. Uh, so, you know, they've helped me settle in. And to be honest, um, I'd heard the group's really good. Um, and then today, they all welcome me in and, and you, you know, you feel at home because First day can always be a bit daunting, so um, so yeah, no, they've really they've really helped me. It's a really good group of keepers here. Always looks like quite a laugh, but also very competitive uh, when it comes to the games in training. Is that a good mix for keepers to have, like friendliness, supporting each other, with a hint of competitiveness as well? Yeah, of course. Yeah, I think um, as everyone knows, the goalies are always together, as separate most days. Um, you know, so you need to push each other, but also support each other. Um, you know, so I feel like that's what the, the group has and obviously Dean, the goalie coach, will um, implement that as well. So that the, the lads are working hard, pushing each other, but, you know, having a, a good time at the same time. And you've had a nice chat with Patrick already? Yeah, yeah, I met the manager, um, which was good. Um, you know, I hear all good things about him um, and I can't wait to, you know, work under him. So many teams now, it's important to play out from the back, uh, especially with Palace, we saw it last season. Is that something you feel you're particularly strong at? Yeah, everybody now is um, wanting to you know, play football. I think, like you said, last year you guys did it um, and was good at it. I think um, you know, it's something the modern day goalkeeper needs to have in, in the locker as well. And um, you know, it's something we did at, at West Brom over the last few years. Um, so hopefully I can, I can settle straight in with that as well. And would you say now the next few years are peak years for a goalkeeper kind of from the age of 29? Because you almost, you need those few years of loans to get experience, don't you? Yeah, yeah. I think like 29 for a goalkeeper, like you said, is coming into your peak. And, um, you know, that's, that's where I'm at at the moment. Um, obviously I had my loans growing up and then did my first permanent move to West Brom for the last four years, um, which was great. And, um, like you said, it's, it's time now to, to do another step and go again. What would you say was the, the secret to your good form at West Brom? Um, look, right, we was in a good team. We, I, I work hard. Um, I think my standards are high. You know, it's something I'm always looking to improve. So, you know, that can always help me. Um, so, so yeah, I think, I think that's, that's the, the secret really is I do, you know, work away from the club and things like that and I think all that helps when you're on the pitch. And for a goalkeeper, what is the difference between playing in the Premier League and playing in the Championship? Uh, I think the, there is a big difference quality-wise. Um, um, you know, Championship's a lot. Saturday, Tuesday, Saturday, Tuesday. Um, and Premier League, you know, is Saturday, the odd midweek game. Um, so you have all week to, to prepare yourself for that important game on a weekend, majority of the season. Um, so, so yeah, look, you're going to come across world-class players um, in the Premier League. And, that, you know, that's something you don't get in the Championship. You're talking world-class players, you played you're in the Euro squad last year. What was that experience like? 
Yeah, unbelievable. Um, great experience, something you know you'll live with forever. Um, you know, it feels a bit weird thinking about it that you was there. Um, it was such a um, you know, we, we did well, we got to the final and with it being in England um, and having your family there and stuff like that, so it's being in that squad, um, training every day, preparing for them high level games, um, you know, is, is something that, you know, everybody dreams of. How fired up are you to try and get in, back in that England squad? Yeah, of course, yeah, this, um, once you've had a taste of it, you, 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 you want to keep going and, and um, getting into them squads and being again with high level players like I will be here day in day out um, you know so that's that's the name personally for me to, to get back in them squads um, um, so hopefully I settle in well here and that can be something that we're looking forward to. And finally what do you think the aim should be for Crystal Palace this season? Um, you know I think if we do as well as what you guys did last year and better is is a great a great opportunity for the lads to you know take on what they did last year into this season and um, you know get a, get higher up that table. I think the lads will obviously have loved being doing well last year, being a success, finishing um, in a good position in the Premier League. But I think. As footballers, you want to better yourselves, you want to do better. So I think that would be an aim for everyone at the club, um, all the players and staff to, to do it again and, and, and better. Thanks, Sam, and best of luck. Perfect. Thank you very much. Cheers.